Michael McKeegan is a Northern Irish musician best known as the bassist of rock band Therapy. In 1988, McKeegan, along with his two brothers Kieran and Charlie, formed a heavy metal band, Evil Priest. The group recorded two demo cassettes, Pretension is No Excuse and Hear No Evil. The fledgling group disbanded in 1989 when Michael McKeegan joined Therapy. In 1989, while McKeegan was still at school, his classmate Fife Ewing handed him a four-song cassette that he had recorded with Andy Cairns, entitled 30 Seconds of Silence. McKeegan was so impressed he immediately joined his therapy's bassist, and soon recorded his first material with the band, another four-track demo tape entitled Meat Abstract. He has since recorded 15 studio albums, two compilation albums and numerous EPs. Along with Cairns, McKeegan is the only original member still with the band. In the late 1990s, McKeegan joined the short-lived Belfast-based group, Sons of Massey, along with his brother Charlie McKeegan, Robin G. Shields and Paul Kingan. The group played live around Northern Ireland and recorded a demo at Einstein Studios in County Antrim. In November 2014, McKeegan along with Andy Cairns recorded 15 tracks for a side project called East Antrim in Belfast Start Studio with fellow Northern Irish musicians including Robin G. Shields, Desert Hearts, Brian Coney, La Faro and Goons. It's an electronic record, with a lot of spoken word and it deals in a very late night ambient sound. It remains unreleased. In August 2015, McKeegan contributed bass to recordings of an original song purveyor of quackery and a cover of Another Girl Another Planet by The Only Ones. The group, consisting of fellow therapy? Members Andy Cairns and Neil Cooper, alongside Diamond Dave Thompson on vocals and Rich Jones on lead guitar, was known as the Gemmels. Backing vocals were contributed by Ricky Warwick, Tim Wheeler, Robin G. Shields, Tom Dalgetty, and Stevie Firth. A 7 Inches was produced and presented to Cairns as a 50th birthday gift. Just 10 copies were pressed and the single was not made public. In 2017, McKeegan joined with X Throat slash Dutch Schultz members Rory McGone, vocals and guitar, and Willie Mendel to form Haunch. The group's debut album Lay My Bones Beside the Others was released on January 26, 2018 via Black Tragic Records. In the March 1998 issue of Guitar Magazine. McKeegan stated, Chris Sheldon recommended I hired in this music man Stingray, then we wangled that the higher cost came off the price, so in the end I bought it for 500 quid which is a bargain. It's the best bass I've ever played. I got a new Mesa slash boogie head and a Mesa slash boogie cab as well, 2x15s whereas I usually use an 8x10, I needed something to really give a big bottom end cause on some tracks I tuned down to D or even C. I used a Boss Bass Overdrive too. But some of the more fuzzy bass is Mr. Color Sound and his wonderful pedals again. Then I use the pitch shift on a Digitech whammy pedal for some of the higher notes. Oh, and I attack the bass with the leg off Martin's cello. It's a very useful thing to have around. In August 2003, he posted the following message on the official therapy website For Trouble Gum and Infernal Love, I used the black status bass with an Ampeg SVT1 head and an Ampeg 8x10 cabinet. For semi detached, I used the Sunburst Music Man and a Mesa Boogie 4U Plus through a Mesa Boogie 2x15 cabinet. Suicide Pact was the Sunburst Music Man with the Mesa 400 Plus head through the Ampeg 8x10, Shameless was the Blue Music Man through a Mesa 400 Plus and a 2x15 Mesa cabinet. High Anxiety was the Blue Music Man with various weird heads through a Hart 4X10 cabinet. In conjunction with all these setups I normally use a Sans Amp Bass Driver Pedal and Boss Bass Overdrive and Morley Bass was for the squally sounds. Hope you are confused. I am. For the record I never had a Westone Thunder 1A. That is a reference to Andy's first ever bass guitar but I never dabbled. Aria Pro 2 when I could afford them. Other guitars. Status Buzzard. Fender Sunburst Precision and a Sunburst Fender Jazz have all made appearances on record and live. Nicknamed the Evil Priest, McKeegan is known for his friendliness towards therapy. S fans, during gigs he often converses with members of the audience between songs, and regularly posts messages on the band's official message boards. He lives in Belfast. With his Dutch wife whom he married in September 2008 and their two sons. He appeared as a judge on BBC Northern Ireland's ATL Rock School 2007. Since 2013, McKeegan has written a monthly column for the UK's bass guitar magazine, where he also reviews bass guitars and amplifiers. Thanks for watching.